Yo, Shawarminator haters. Hey, Shawarminator haters. Hello, Shawarminator haters. Hello, Shawarminator haters. Today is a good day because it's sunny. And today is a day that we've got the Shawarminator truck parked outside a British Petroleum or BP on this beautiful grassy knoll and we are getting ready to feed Panorama. Right, let's get to work, yo. It seems to me that in so, order, uh, know, another day, go Panorama, and uh, I'm gonna try and sell some chicken shawarmas today. Shawarma goes. going. And then we've got massage machine. Another day, another shawarma sold to the people of Cape Town. It was a good day. It's always good when this is empty. So we're here at Anglo Auctioners in Somerset West to try and uh, see if we can get our hands on some uh, secondhand catering equipment that is in good condition, which we already checked out yesterday. It's the first auction I've ever been in, so it's gonna be fun. There it is, first time. Like a scene from a horror movie. I mean, honestly, sunbathing in style okay so that was interesting got what we a couple of things that we needed it was just a bit odd because some people were bidding on stuff that they can get brand new for almost the same price if not less but we got what we needed only two items really the other stuff i just found too expensive so the verdict is it's a very interesting bidding wars that go around I was actually in a bidding war for some trays it's insane so I guess that's what the whole point of a auction is isn't it okay peace not a mixed martial artist so <laughs> I just love punching a bag it feels good I'm gonna show you my skills that I ain't got yo I'm no MMA fighter probably my techniques wrong I followed YouTube one of the things I like to do is uh, it's not CrossFit, it's cross training, where I substitute the uh, the typical I don't know jumping jacks or running upstairs portion of the cross training, which is about 45 seconds. I substitute it for punching a bag, and then after that I do a whole bunch of drills, whether it's push-ups, kettlebell swings, kettlebell press-ups, sit-ups, and burpees, and all that sort of thing. And it gets you unbelievably worked out. It's it's beautiful. All right. That's 32 minutes. It's only two sets. I'm done. Shawarminated out. I'll put down the, the exercise routine I did, if anyone's interested. All 17 viewers of you. Maybe you guys can try it out. You'll probably kick my ass. Man. So fit. Right. I need a shawarma. Fifth of June, we're on our way to the Grand West Casino to watch 
EFC 30. That's Extreme Fighting Championships Africa. Uh, some of you might know if you follow my feeds, I am a huge fan of mixed martial arts. And in particular, the UFC, the EFC, although the EFC I've very slowly started to get into it. Because, you, know, you know, typically you just follow what's really being promoted quite heavily, and that's the UFC. And let's see how it goes. Very exciting. It's my first time ever being at a live event like this, and I'm so stoked. I'm so, so stoked. I hope I meet some of the fighters, and maybe if they give me permission, I'll just let them, you know, I, I could put them on the video, and you guys can kind of meet them, so to speak. And yeah, that's it. Right. Excited. All right, here we are. Chunk, 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 chunk. I'm gonna go watch EFC. The judges have scored this bout 48 47 Mash. 49 46 Allen. Oh, wow. And 49 49. Huh? Declaring this bout a draw. A split draw. It was all match. No offense, boy, but he really did get it. Right, so it was an unbelievably exciting night. I didn't get a chance to, you know, get an interview. I just didn't want to, you know, thrust myself or force myself on fighters. They, they, they just look tired and stuff, and I just, you know, they have to deal with hundreds of fans and things, so I figured I'll just let it go this time. Overall, in a very, very great and successful event. Right, let's see what I could do with this in the vlog. Edit. Right. Good night, everyone.